Good afternoon, this is Daniel Frenchers here at Marine Max Orlando. Today I am doing the walkthrough video of this brokerage listing that we have here. This is a 2022 Sea Ray 250 SCX. This is the stern drive version. You'll see that this has a great color combination. The Sea Ray full hole, uh, Sea Ray blue full hole color with the white sports tower with the Sea Ray blue accent panel there. So it's a great color combination. It looks great on the water. It looks even better on the trailer. Um, you'll see that this boat is 25 feet. Uh, this boat does not have a trailer, but we will have a trailer if you do need one. And uh, you'll see that this has the stainless steel rub rail, the stainless steel package. You got your fender pros that will go in here. You just pop them in and your fenders will go down um, exactly where they need to be. You can change it from both sides. This boat does have these sea deck on the swim platform as well as throughout the boat you'll see that this has the bravo 3 drive so it's a counter rotating propeller this is a 300 horsepower uh, mercury uh, merc cruiser motor and then what's really nice on this boat specifically is that you do have this drop down swim swim platform here so what it does is it allows you to sit in the water without having to jump off. You can actually have your kids play, use this to step back up. And it does have a safety feature, with, uh, which are these magnetic, um, basically kill switches, where it won't let you start the engine if this is down. So that's really nice for safety feature purposes. And then you'll see it's heavy duty, big stainless steel components, and it's really nice feature to have. You got a nice um, uh, pull out ladder there, stainless steel as well. You got your tow hook here. And what's really cool about uh, this swim platform here, but the option that we chose when he ordered it is that he's got a transom uh, switch for his trim. So you could sit back here and you can adjust the trim. Let's say if you're at the sandbar and the tide is going out, you want to lift or you want to put the motor down, you could do it from here instead of having to climb all the way in the boat. But uh, we'll actually climb in the boat now. Swim platform of this 2022 25SCX. You see that you do have a nice big lounge here. You've got a cup holder and it does have the premium audio system here. But you've got a nice big through um, compartment uh, storage space here where he's got his life jackets there and then your battery access there as well. You've got USB uh, charging points here and a 12 volt uh, receptacle there so you can charge your phone you can blow up your um, your water coolers and stuff like that and this layout is my favorite out of all the sea rays just because it's got a nice different interesting layout it seems way more roomier than it actually is uh, and uh, you do have a nice head so when you're walking through this boat you'll see that you do have your gas fill there your transom switch there and then you also have your uh, cooler that will drain overboard so this is great for sitting down on this lounge here and you can pack your cooler not have to get up just really enjoy the sandbar and stuff you'll see that you do have along with your cooler everything is controllable back here so your trim your stereo you've got your USBs your cups and everything like that but you have a nice a nice remote there so you can turn up the music and everything there and last but not least on the transom here, you do have a fresh water shower. So you're getting in from the salt water or the fresh water. You can rinse off the sand from your feet or rinse off your body in general. And then coming through the boat, you'll see that this does have a flip-flop seat here. So this will go back and forth. Really nice feature to have. And you can face rear or while you're going have people face forward. And it makes a really nice area here continue with the walkthrough here you've got your battery switch right when you walk on the boat and let's say you are going to a, uh, a marina that's a little bit higher up you have a step right here and then non-skid here so if you need to step up to a higher level you can and then you got a little doggy door little transom door there you can open or close that if you have small dogs or anything like that just something in the way so they don't just jump right out um, you'll see that this boat has a uh, a battery charger here so you can plug in your extension cord there and always make sure it's charged this is easy access to your your engine compartment here so you get the 300 horsepower mercury merc cruiser 6.2 liter v8 here really nice um, engine really quiet ride as well 
And then of course you got the battery charger and a whole bunch of storage down there as well. Uh, speaking of storage, you got storage under all these compartments. So you've got your cooler underneath this one. Um, the carry-on cooler does come with it, but it's not there at the moment. And then you've got the other side of the storage that goes all the way through to the back. That is your stanchion for your table. You got, of course, cup holders that are recessed into the seating as well, so it's not gonna uh, spill, and they're not in high places where they're gonna spill on the, the nice interior. You see that the interior is in the dune, so it is really nice. And then you have your, your tower here, which by the pull of this lever and the lever on the uh, starboard side, this will actually come down below the windshield. So if you need to get under a bridge, you can. Um, continuing with the layout of the interior, you do have these nice flip-flop seats here. So whether you're driving or you're the passenger, you could always face forward. And then if you're at uh, anchor, you could turn back this way and have everybody in here. Put your table in the middle there and have a nice picnic underneath your bimini, underneath the shade. And then coming to the bow, there's a lot on this boat, but coming to the bow, you've got your port side entry here. So you've got a nice big open bow area. This does have the filler cushions here. So this turns all into one big lounge. And then you've got another um, uh, bow freshwater sprayer. So if you're getting on the bow, but you have your bow ladder there if you're going to a sandbar. You can easily get on, don't have to swim around to the transom to get back on, but you're still able to wash yourself off, get up here, and then hang out. You've got your second carry-on cooler underneath this compartment here, so they made it easily accessible. You can easily take that off, and then you've got your nice seating storage underneath these uh, compartments there, and you can put fenders or anything else like that. And then you also have lighting. So this boat is fully rigged out with the RGB lighting. So you've got it in your speakers, you've got it underneath your cushions, and then you'll see that you have even more USB chargers there and recessed cup holders. You see you got a little window there. The reason for the window is because you have this port side walkthrough, which gives you an enormous space in the head for a 25 foot boat. We'll go check that out. So because of the the port side entry here you do have a huge head here so if you are in the if you're in a storm or anything like that or it's just a breezy day and you want to get out of the wind you can shut your windshield you can shut your windshield door and then you will block off any wind there but the best feature about this layout is the huge compartment that you have in here so with this boat it does have the optioned uh, porta potty with the pump out head it does have the interior head upgrade so you can actually put this down like so and you have a nice like little day bed in here so if you have little kids or you just want to take a nap you've got that area and then there's of course storage underneath those seats as well so that's really nice and the door they thought of everything you have a lockable glove compartment here and then um, the last thing for storage wise you've got a huge ski locker here you can see there's multiple fenders you got a nice teak table that'll go right in the cockpit here all your lines and fenders and anything that you want can fit in there and you could actually fit a couple of kids in there if you really wanted to so last but not least we'll come to the helm here so you do have your mercury um, ignition here you got a cup holder all the cup holders speakers and seats all have lighting in them you've got a 12 inch upgraded uh, simrad chart plotter gps uh, mercury engine gauge everything like that this boat has just under 60 hours on it and uh, it's ready to go actually but you got your uh, premium audio system so your fusion head unit subwoofer speakers everywhere and remotes everywhere as well and there's just a lot more to go over with this boat at the helm but this is a great boat for the friends and family could really extend the day out on the water but this is daniel french here at marine max orlando showing this 2022 sea ray 250 stx give me a call 407-590-0493